Well, I don't open mind to everyone because I get a lot of these uh, requests from these people, you know, and usually they're like good looking men in military uniforms. And uh, I don't even walk them or ignore them, I just don't respond to them. Uh, but if they're people who I have 10 or more friends in common with, then I'll accept them. Or I might go to their profile and go, oh, okay, they live in Santa Barbara, that's why, or oh, they're an author, that's why they requested me as a friend. And then I will accept them. Um, and if you want to build up your Facebook uh, friends, I go to some of these people who have a lot of Facebook friends, like Marla, and I'll look at her friends and see, oh, okay, I have 10 friends in common with that person, let me add them. Um, and, and just go through the list and then you can build up your own friends list that way. That's the difference between a profile and a page. Okay. If you have a profile, then, and a lot of authors will do this, is they will just have a profile where they can have up to 5,000 uh, friends. Okay. And you can, they'll post photos of their cats and you can comment on that or you can post on their page. You can wish them happy birthday on their, on their profile. Or some authors have a page where you can't post on it and people will see it publicly. You can send them messages through their page, okay. Okay. but you can't publicly post something on to their page's timeline. If you look up at the top and it says like, that means it's a page. Okay, so you, you really want someone to like your page as opposed to having these strangers all on here promoting their own <coughs> stuff on there, com commenting on their stuff, right? I think you can like that. You can open that up or lock the comments down on your business page. I keep mine open. I want to know what everybody thinks. <laughs> you know, right? I think yeah. you're worrying about people who come on and especially spammers. if you, spammers, yeah. Yeah. especially like if you, uh, you say, oh yes, I know that person, so I will, I will accept their friend request. Sometimes that's a duplicate, a spammer who has set, a du set up a duplicate profile of those people. They just steal their photos and set up a, a fake profile. And a lot of times they get caught and blocked right away. But sometimes you'll accept them, and then all of a sudden you'll see all these ads for sunglasses and stuff on your, on your, on your timeline, your own personal timeline. And if somebody does it or somebody has an event and they tag you in it and it ends up on your timeline and you're like, you know, that's not really what I want my, to be on my timeline, mm -hmm. you can always hide that. Click the little arrow in the right hand corner and say, hide this from my timeline or remove the tag so that you're not tagged in it.